Guys, I have a regret. This is something that is bothering me. It's been bothering me for the past couple of years. And I want to share it with you because I want to share the lesson that I've learned. I also want to share what I'm doing about it because I believe that it can help you as well. So the feeling of regret that I have right now, and this goes for about the past five years back to 2018 or so, is that I regret not shooting, recording, and distributing more video content just like this. Now, I'm not here to throw a pity party or feel bad about myself or you know beat myself up or anything like that because the past is the past. What are we gonna do about it? There are two things we can do about the past. We can look at the past and say, man, woe is me, I failed, I messed up. Or we can reframe that past experience as a learning lesson to propel us forward. So over the past five years, I've created a decent amount of video content. You guys might think it's a lot because you're always seeing my face and our content out there, the videos, the podcasts. We try to be as omnipresent as possible. The fact of the matter is, I feel like we're only about 10% of what we could be doing. The reason is because this opportunity is massive. And the opportunity I'm talking about is to make this connection that we're making right now. So I've been shooting video content for, I don't know, seven or eight years, gotten pretty serious about it the last three or four years after following guys like Gary V, Grant Cardone, you know, just try to do as much of it as possible. And my life and our business has transformed as a direct result of this video content. Now, why is that? It is because of this connection. Every day, we talk with people in our market, with roofers, with contractors who reach out like, man, I feel like I know you. I've been following your podcast, I've been following your video content. You guys are speaking my language. I want to talk about how we can work together. So that's great. Getting clients, awesome. Beyond that, going to events, interacting with people online, interacting with our customers, getting feedback on the content that we put out that has impacted their lives. It might be something as simple as time management. It might be something as simple as a push-up challenge that I'm running right now for September, where we're getting feedback from many people inside that group that it's been something that's been transformational for them and they don't want it to end. It might be business tips, it might be marketing tips, it might be some of the guests we've had on our podcast and on this YouTube channel. And I want more of that juice. I want to impact more people. And just this, shooting videos right now on my iPhone with this mic, that's all we need. It's free. This, what I'm doing right now is free. Yeah, we're going to pay our editing team to edit this and make me look better and make me sound smarter and make it, you know, jazz it up with some graphics and stuff like that. But you don't have to do that. Mr. Beast got started by shooting videos on his phone in his bedroom when he was a teenager. And now look at him. So you don't have to be fancy to get started, but you do need to get started. And I want to 10x the amount of content that we're doing. I've been sitting out here by my pool for the past two days in this chair, shooting dozens of videos because I'm, I blocked out my calendar. I'm so focused on this. This video content, this audio content, we dripped out over the next three months. I'm getting really into it. I'm getting passionate about it. I'm turning it up a notch. I'm planning the content out more because I know that we're impacting people with this content. I want to impact more to help and support other people. And yes, grow our business. Of course, that's a big part of it. And I want you to do that too. Yeah, written content is great. Yeah, before and after images of your fancy projects, they're awesome, but nothing makes a connection as much as this video does because 90% of communication is nonverbal. It's my inflection. It's the way I'm moving my hands. It's the way that my eyes are locked into the camera right now. And that's what I want you to do to your market because we get people reaching out to us every day. Hey, I love your stuff. I'm right there with you. I get it. Can't wait to work with you. We're not ready yet, but I can't wait to work with you. I can't wait to meet you at an event. And that's not like an ego thing. That's more like, man, I'm so glad that we are having an impact on people. I'm so glad that we are attracting not just customers, but like the right people that are there are people that we are working together for for years on end. And I want that for you too. Maybe you're not going to work with your customers for years on end, but wouldn't it be awesome to get those inbound leads and appointments and sales from property owners? We're like, man, we want to work with you. We know that we need a new roof. We've known it for six months. We're just ra waiting for the right time, but like we're ready for you to do our roof. That happens. If that hasn't happened for you, then believe me, that happens all the time. It happens to our clients, that happens to other companies that do a good job of building that brand and building that know, like, and trust and getting people to know about them and associate them with them in a positive way. And the accelerant to that process is this, is this video, faces on video. Every day when we're talking to prospective clients, 
roofing companies and they're like, man, I really want my marketing to work. I really want to make this thing work. And we go to their website, we go to their social media profiles and they might have a fancy website. They just spent $20,000 to get done. It looks great. Hey man, you got stock photos in your website. Who are those random ass people on your website? Like that's a stock photo. Get your people on there, get your projects on there. Go to the social media. Okay, there's cute little graphics they made on Canva with like, hey, you know, roofs and stuff like that. Great, everyone else does that. Get your face on video, that's what's missing. Faces on video, that's the connection that we want. That's my regret that I did not like 10X triple down on the video stuff over the past five years, but that's okay. I think we did a lot, but moving forward, I'm freeing up more of my time and some other of our leaders on our team like Benny and Elizabeth and Sydney are freeing up more of their time so that we can do more of this type of content, more of this video content so we can have a bigger impact so we can continue to grow our business with the right types of people and not just customers, by the way, or clients, but attracting team members to join our mission. We've hired a bunch of people this year. Our team is triple the size that it was last year. And most of those people have come to us through our social media network. I think the last two came from LinkedIn, which is great, but the majority of people have come through social media. Media. And that's the power of this video. So I want to communicate that and committed to, I don't know if it's going to be 10X because it takes a lot of time and effort to do all that. But like, we're going to triple down on our video content and our podcast content and do more of it. And I don't want to look back in three years and be like, man, 2023, I wish I started doing more video. Like I want to do that now. And I don't want to do that now because it's going to flood our pipeline with leads next week. No, guys, it doesn't work like that. The work that I'm doing right now is going to benefit our business for the next five years. In 2025, I and my team are going to be extremely happy that we committed to doing this content in 2023. These videos that I've shot over the last couple of days, I, I, re I feel really good about them. We'll see how they turn out. We'll see how you guys respond to them because ultimately that's the judge of how, how good they are, right? It's not how good I think they are. It's how good our market thinks they are. But I feel really confident that these videos, the last couple of days that I've shot sitting here by my pool, they're gonna be worth millions of dollars to our business. And I say that without exaggeration. And they're gonna open up opportunities that, that we don't even know exist. That is the power of video. I've already seen it and I already regret not doing more of it. And I'm committing to doing more of it now. And I'm sharing this with you because I want you to commit to it. I want you to get over your fear, get over your discomfort, get out of your comfort zone, get out of your own way, make time in your calendar. We're not gonna find the time, guys. We make the time for what's important. And I'm telling you that this is important for your business. This is important for your family's future. This is important for your team members. This is important for your market, for your customers, for your future customers. This is important to save property owners from working with roofing contractors who have no idea what they're doing and are not gonna provide a great service. You have a responsibility to help those property owners out. And if you're holding yourself back from getting on video, then you're holding them back from getting a truly amazing product and service that you can provide for them. So you're being selfish by staying in your comfort zone, by not making the time to do this, all right? That might sound extreme and yeah, sure, maybe it is, but I just wanna drive this point home, right? So my regret is that over the past five years, I have not done more video, but I'm a big boy. I'm an adult. I'm going to frame that up as, hey, that's a learning experience. What am I going to do about that moving forward? How am I going to take that information and mold that into something that is going to propel us forward? That's it, guys. Get out there, do your videos, commit to it, hold yourself accountable to it because it can make a massive difference because it will make a massive difference in your business, in your personal life, in your market, in your team members and their families' lives. All right, good, got a deal, handshake, shaking on it. If you guys need any tips on like what to say in your videos or you know how to shoot them or how to look as handsome as I do, just kidding. We've got a whole YouTube library of videos. We've got a whole 175 podcast episodes. And if you can't find anything in there, feel free to reach out to me, drop a comment below. Hit me up on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Joseph Hughes. Head on over to my website at josephhughes.co or our company website, contractordynamics.com. Get in touch, don't make excuses. We don't bite, we're here to support, all right? Let's go get it.